Welcome back to a brand new video on our channel. Today, we're delving into a fascinating topic, understanding different types of crushes. Do you ever feel nervous or excited when you see or think about someone you're attracted to? Do you hope that they like you back? It's common to view everything a person you have feelings for does in a positive light, but not every crush is someone you should pursue a romantic relationship with. In this article, we'll discuss seven types of crushes you might want to avoid. 1. The Disappearing Act Do you find yourself talking to your crush occasionally, but they often vanish from your life? They may also ignore you or avoid meeting in person. It's possible that they have feelings for you, but instead of either accepting or rejecting you, they choose to disappear. This could be because they're uncomfortable with rejecting people or they fear commitment. Remember, you deserve someone who values your feelings rather than taking the easy way out. 2. The Braggart does your crush boast to their friends about your feelings for them? Are they leading you on, giving you false hope? Sometimes they might do this just to boost their own ego, not because they genuinely care about you. They may have indirectly learned about your feelings and pretend not to know. They keep you close even though they don't share your feelings because you make them feel good about themselves. But remember, this behavior is emotionally immature and can lead to a lot of emotional problems for you. 3. The Humiliator does your crush take jokes too far, making others visibly upset? Do they refuse to apologize or change their behavior despite knowing they've hurt someone? This is a concerning sign to watch out for. If your crush humiliates others to make themselves look better, they may have self-esteem or trust issues. You could become a target of these problems in a relationship with them. 4. The Bully Is your crush disrespectful to employees or strangers? Are they unkind to your friends? These are some of the behaviors you should be aware of when it comes to your crush. It's important to choose a partner who treats you with respect and kindness and who values your feelings and well-being. Text 2. Signs you shouldn't date your crush. Some people are drawn to the idea of falling for the bad boy or bad girl, but loving someone who is rude or mean to others can lead to suffering. Even if they treat you well, their behavior towards others is a major warning sign. Everyone deserves respect and love, and there's no guarantee they won't treat you the same way they treat others. 5. The Cheater Have you heard from others, especially your crush's exes, that your crush has a history of cheating? If so, it might not be a good idea to date them. A study in the Archives of Sexual Behavior found that someone who has cheated on a partner before is three times more likely to cheat again in their next relationship compared to someone who hasn't cheated. Repeated cheating indicates underlying commitment issues that your crush needs to address before entering a successful relationship. You deserve someone who respects the boundaries of your relationship. 6. The Freeloader Does your crush constantly ask you or others for favors without giving anything in return? If they suspect you have feelings for them, they might keep asking for favors, knowing you'll see it as a chance to get closer to them. Even if they promise to reciprocate, it doesn't seem like they intend to keep those promises. If you keep falling into the same pattern of being used, it might be a good idea to take a break from relationships. Therapy can also help you break these patterns. 7. The Isolator Does your crush frequently try to change your plans with other people and sow discord with your friends and family? If so, this is a major warning sign. Falling for an isolator can lead to a psychologically abusive relationship. If you notice signs of your crush trying to control who you talk to or what you do, it's crucial to end any form of relationship with them. While it can be challenging to move on from your feelings for someone, sometimes it's necessary. When your crush doesn't reciprocate your feelings, behaves immaturely, or displays these red flags, it can make your relationship with them difficult or even abusive. It's better to move on. Falling in love can be exciting, but it shouldn't harm your physical or mental well-being. Have you noticed any of these signs in your crush or someone you know? Do you think these red flags can be easy for someone with a crush to recognize? If you enjoyed this video, give it a thumbs up and share it with your friends so we can keep making them. For more videos like this, hit the subscribe button and remember to click on the notification bell. Also, be sure to check out our other videos as well. Thanks for watching.